Um, so isn't this the irony right here? Um, just talking about uh, drama and manipulation and people getting sucked into it and, you know, sides saying, hey, jump on my side and fight against them here and there, this and that, and the other. And check it out, y'all. I'm watching fucking CNN and fucking Duck Dynasty debate. So now every black person's pissed off and every gay person's pissed off and now they're all mad because this guy made his little comments on his reality show. Um, I think that's fucking hilarious. And it shows the media manipulation of the masses. See, Duck Dynasty, viewed by the most people, whatever. Number one show, whatever. And this guy makes a comment, pisses off some people. They just all throw it out in the air and want to get a big old war started, you know. And get everybody looking and focusing on something that doesn't matter. You know what I'm saying? I mean, the guy had in his opinion. He made it his opinion. You know, that's how he sees things. And now people are pissed about it. Just because they're pissed about it, they decided they're going to go ahead and create this big, huge uproar and get their panties in a ball and just focus everybody's time and energy on something that does not matter. Somebody else's opinion. You know what I'm saying? Somebody else's opinion doesn't change your life. You know what I'm saying? It's their opinion. You know what I'm saying? You can take it and grow with it or take it and throw it away. You know what I'm saying? It's a fucking opinion. And and get people to jump drama and participate with your debate is fucking acidine. It's bullshit. You know what I'm saying? It's division and drama. And this is it once again. I started to point that out. Um... Here's some of the crap they're saying. Uh, to me, it brought to light something a little bit different. I think there was an aspect of this article that was a hit piece. Uh, there was some mocking of faith and Christianity in this article as well. I would have loved to have been there and seen the whole day and the interaction because I think what you see here is a guy that said something that was very politically incorrect. It's not the way it should have been said. But at the same time, I don't like how people are reacting, implying that he said things or implied things that he didn't say. For example, there's a big article today that said he said in this article that he believed all gays go to hell. That's not what he said in this article. And I want to make sure that we make it very clear. He said sins make you go to hell. If See, and they're just going to nitpick it and they're going to take it apart and they're going to analyze every little thing he said and every little thing that anybody else says and what everybody else's opinion is and as you saw just then that guy he makes his comments and another guy's like uh you know what i'm saying just doing the whole dramatic bullshit you know what i'm saying i mean it's it's crap you know what i'm saying it's drama it's bullshit you know what i'm saying your news station is nothing but reality tv show drama it's all fucking Smoke and mirrors just to fucking keep you fucking worried about shit that doesn't matter. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm pretty sure that old Phil from Duck Dynasty doesn't give a fuck about what CNN and everybody else is saying about him. I'm sure he doesn't give a fuck about A&E or the show. You know what I'm saying? The man's happy. And, um, you know, he has his own beliefs. And if he loses the show, I don't think he gives a fuck. You know what I'm saying? He's already made it. You know what I'm saying? From nothing to where he's at. And he ain't gonna let this shit affect him. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm just thinking that that's how this mug's going to handle it. I could be wrong. But I do know that the media... Oh, my God. Okay. Okay, so, boom. Look at that. Sarah Palin has something to say. Bill Robertson, for voicing his personal opinion, are taking on all of us. Here is what I pose to, to any three of you all, because let's, let's, let's remember Sarah Palin that, not too long ago called out MSNBC. That's so stupid. Year, you know what I'm saying? Because of his remarks, See, Sarah now it gets political. See, they take... Your reality show, now they bring your politicians into it, and they just, you know, it's a big, it's a big bullshit thing, okay? So, y'all can enjoy y'all's little Christmas drama on TV, uh, apparently Duck Dynasty's big, you can see it all in Walmart, you can see it now on the news, um, you know, y'all have a good one.